Okay, so this is a real quick walkthrough of how we have things temporarily wired up. Battery pack that will be on the back of the suit to power up the entire electronic package. We have a model of Michael's hand with a glove, the light hanging on the front with wires hanging off the back. They will be connected by a two-pin connector to the uh, hand plate, which will be mounted on the wrist piece of armor. So that will just sit on the back of his hand like so. So that when he tips his hand back, that will turn this, push this hinged piece back. And the effect of that, obviously, is that that becomes your trigger. So, how we get that done on the inside, I apologize for the horrible focus. I have a stripped down circuit board from the toy uh, with nothing left but the speaker part of the circuit board. I've cut it down to just having the microprocessor, uh, the connections for power, uh, resistor, and a capacitor, and uh, the connections to both power and to the light. And then I've wired in a teeny tiny little micro switch. I think I took that off of a flash camera, one of the push buttons for that. But the thing that makes this work is the little ribbon uh, that runs back and forth between the uh, the piece that's in the back here where it's mounted through the little tunnel here and then just slides up and down up there. It has a stopper on it and that stopper when you pull it far enough hits the micro switch which then fires your pulses. So that is the way that I've got this temporarily wired up and uh, once I clean up all the wiring and put the two pin connectors on it should be as simple as snapping the glove into the repulsor which is mounted on the wrist plate and away Mikey can go.